Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Thea, The Awakening. It's back. You thought it was gone. I thought it was gone. It's not. It's back. It's here. It's now. I'm going to stop talking before I sound even more like an idiot than I already do. So, here we go. Um, so, it's been a little while, as you can tell, that I, I actually haven't played this in a while. I just went through looking at stuff. I think what our plan was, was we were taking our expedition and coming up here. In fact, I know that's what we were going to do, because that's the only thing I can remember from the last time we played the game. So I did look around a little bit. Um, Wolf's Paw down here. We have we have all of our guys, Alexandra, Dobby, Trebuslava, Pezzi, Lubvid, Lubvid, Lubvid. Uh, we got these guys making dark wood swords and bigos. And we got our people up here gathering some fruit. So we're just going to end our turn right now and start moving forwards. Alright. Excuse me, because I'm going to be going into really bad accents this whole time because I don't know. I'm just in that kind of a mood. So if, um, if my bad attempt at accents insults you, then... Oh well. Tough luck. Um, I won't change. Just to suit you. We got one Sculler here. Um, I think we can take that pretty easily. I mean, our expedition isn't the strongest, but I'm pretty sure we can take on a one Skull fight. So, uh, you approach your enemies and have time to decide on a plan. Okay. So we can just go straight in for a fight. Um, why whisk? Why risk a frontal assault when the shadows await? Um, so we could sneak, or we can let's play this. Uh, we can tack. We can use tactics. Let's play this part partisan style. Okay, whatever that is. Draw them out and pick them off one by one. That would be pretty cool. So I know we're strong in a fight. Uh, let's see what if we did a. So we got um, tactical. So if we went tactics, um, our stats are not very strong. What is will? What would will be for us? Will is a primary defense skill in many challenges, including social next. Not something we need here. What else? So we have tactics and we have sneak. So if this was a sneaking challenge, how would we do? Uh, we don't have very much dex. Uh, well, no, we do have quite a bit of dexterity. What is... Distraction. Oh, okay. And sneak and hide challenges damages the enemy and heals you from distraction. For distraction amount. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. So we could do that, or we could just go for the all-out um, fight, where our people are really, really strong. Um, I mean, there is more of a risk. Uh, there's a risk of our people dying, but it is one skull, so we're just going to do it. A witch and hunting rats, we're just going to auto-resolve. Dead, pretty easy. Shouldn't have looked at, read that much into it, but we did, unfortunately. And we have one move left, so we can go ahead and camp. Awesome. All right. So, let's go ahead. Um, I don't think we need firewood. No, we've got loads of firewood. We don't even really need food, but we might as well. Um, rats, I thought we were going to be in range for this food. Guess not. Oh, well. Guess we might as well gather up some vegetables and gather up some wood because there's no thing else we can do, so we might as well. Um, we got three big us. Uh, we have unused science. Um, let's see, crafting, production, so we can go ahead and queue up some more bigus, we can get a few more, um, and that will be done next turn, so I don't really know, I think what we were going to do was we wanted to get m a little bit more monster bones, because I think we need 25, and we were going to build a watchtower, and we were going to use monster bones up here. Yeah, we need 25 monster bones. 
So we get 25 of those. We can use some of our other materials and stuff. So I think that's what we were trying to do. And we don't quite have 25. You're actually getting quite full now on resources. You don't have any monster bones, do you? No, we need to kill some monsters. Luckily, we have a little thing up there to go to. So we'll end our turn. We got a sword. We got people not doing anything, but that can wait. So let's go ahead and start moving forwards. Oh, we got an encounter. Ooh, you come across goblins encountering and you spot they are holding some humans, including children hostage. All right, so we could kill these green bastards. We can sneak up on them and try to free the prisoners, or we can let them get, or we can let's not get involved and leave. Now, I'd like to get the goblins on my side as opposed to the children, but I think we're going to have to fight them, so we're going to fight them. Goblin warriors. It's a two skull. These guys are at four, four goblin warriors, so let's see what we can do to take them out. So we have first strike, so we can give all of our guys first strike, so that'll be good. So, I think we want to make sure our tank is in the front. So let's go ahead and send out Zwana first. And see how strong these next guys are. Alright, so Goblin Warrior. He's pretty strong. Yeah, he's pretty strong, alright. So we could try counter tactics. He's only level 3, so the other guys might only be level 3. We could counter tactics and um, try and get one of these out. But I think we'll send Mick out first. And then we could counter tactics and then just get him and Slav in front in the, as first strike. I think we'll do that. Let's try counter tactics. Get one of these guys out of the way. He's pretty strong too. Good. All right. And then we'll send him and Slav out and first action him right to the front. And they have a goblin warrior. Two of them with pikes. That was less than advantageous. So we'll send out Himoslav, and we will first action him so he's right at the front. He can go ahead, kill that first one, and yeah, kill that first one right away. And then Zuana can kill the second one. Ooh, some slash damage. Awesome. And then we'll kill the other guys really easily on the next one. Next one. Easy! Easy fight! Smash, carry over to the next guy, and Zona, 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 these names, I'm telling you man, these names, these Slavic names, alright, so Mick got four wounds, that's unfortunate, but we got a spear, we got a little wooden spear, we got some bone spiked armor, ooh, made of bones of the fallen enemies, cool. And we got some a leather jerkin, so some more armor, and a studded staff. And we also got a mask and some food and a shield. All right. Good. Welcome those who chose to stay and leave together. So we got, ooh, Dodriken, Dodriken, Dobrochna, Dobrochna. Um, you're going to be named Doris. We're going to rename you Doris. And a child. All right. So let's see how these guys are. So you are a gatherer. All right. Cool. Um, let's get rid of the filter. You have three gather. Um, and you're pretty weak. You have one medic skill, though. That's pretty cool. Uh, you are named Doris. Uh, that's probably not how you spell Doris. In fact, I can confirm that's not how you spell Doris. But that's how I'm going to spell it right now. So we got a boar spear, which is, ooh, okay, so four damage. Or we got a studded staff, which is only three. So you can have the boar spear. It's light. Um, it does mean you can't have anything else, unfortunately. Uh, ooh, this armor is ten and eight with one dex. So it's not as good as the armor we have, but it does give us some other things. So I think we should give, um, we'll get of Doris here the mask as well, because uh, she could be in trouble if she gets hit, um, and she can't care, have either this armor and the spear, so we might as well. She is pretty weak, so we do kind of have to get home with her. She's not really good at 
being out and about. Could give her this club instead. It does have poison damage. It is less damage overall, but that means we could give her a shield, which would help. I think that might be better, actually. Might be better to give her a shield and a club instead. Because that will help keep her alive more. So I think we'll do that. We're going to try and not have her in the main hand very often. But if she does, then that will be good. And then this armor, uh, who, who can take it? So your armor is really good. So you keep your armor. Yours is 10 and 2 decks. So you can keep yours for sure. You have no armor. So how much you have more? You have armor. You will not be able to wear armor. I mean, if we could get some lighter stuff for you, then that would be good. Um, what gather do you have? You have seven gathering. I could give your bucket to her. You okay? So we have two gathers here now. I just realized that. Okay. Um, all right. I'm going to give um Mick some armor. We'll give him the the plus one dex. Yeah, we'll give him the plus one dex. So this the other armor would be better, but the, if this one's lighter, give some dex. So we'll go with that. All right. So that um and now we can go on and move into the other area, I believe. So we can move forwards. We now have a level 2 skeleton tomb, but let's move into the ruins first. Let's explore them. You stumble across some ruins of Search. Earth. One of many Ooh. buildings you tirelessly searched through Thorn. contains a closed stash. It takes you almost an hour yep, to open. Yep, yep. We got a spear. We got th we got a two-handed spear, Thorn. What does that do? I want to check this out. Um, Thorn, 6 damage and 3 poison. Hey, would you rather have this? It's a lot better. Yeah, you you can have that instead. I know that we're taking your shield away again, but that's really, really good. So you can hold on to that for now. All right, all right, good. Cool. Um, We have two moves, so we could move and make camp, but I think we'll just make camp. So that, well... We have lots of food. We could just straight up move. We don't actually have to make camp. We could just move out. There are bad guys here. There are bad guys here. And there are bad guys there. Let's move up this way. Um, You know what? We're going to make camp so we can heal up. We'll just gather up a bunch of wood. And we'll be good. All right. So you guys can do that. I can guarantee we'll get attacked. Um, And now we'll check out Wolf's Paw real quick before... We um, have any other problems. All right, so um, making something. What should we make? We wanted monster bones for the watchtower. Um, what we could unlock something else to make. We can make one-handed swords. We could go with light armor. That could be a good thing to do. Or we could grab jewelry. Um. I'm thinking light armor. That way we can really tank our guys up some more. We can make some better armor. We have some really good armor. Making some better armor wouldn't be bad. Um, I'm trying to think. I don't know. Um, I really don't know. I don't know what to have him do. What should he do? What should he do? What should he do? Um... Is there any other cooked food that we could make? We can make some with herbs. Make some food that has herbs and vegetables. Um, we can make some more gathering tools, but I think we have a good amount. Uh, do you guys both have crafting tools? I wonder. Equipment. Uh, yes, they do. Okay. I don't know. Maybe you know what? we're just gonna. He's just gonna help. Um, he's just gonna help get some vegetables. I guess. I don't really want him to make anything else right now. Um, we have two buildings. We could make another pasture. I don't think we really need to, though. Well, you know what? I want to check out what we could get if we made a pasture real quick. Um, production. I keep forgetting where to go. Pasture. So, if we wanted to use dark wood and vegetables, 
that will give us two attract human and one food. I don't see that being worth it, so nope. All right, so that's going to be it for this episode. Let's end our turn. So they moved up there, and these guys are coming down to attack. Oh, they didn't attack us, really. That's interesting. I would have been sure that they would have. Um, Well, we're going to attack them. So end that and move up here. All right, so we could do the sneak and the tactics again. We could try one of those, or we could just do the straight-up fight. Um, Let's do the straight-up fight. Um, should I auto resolve or should I try? I think we'll go for it. We'll we'll do this one, just to be careful because like I, like Doris here is pretty weak. So let's reshuffle, try and get Doris in the other hand, and we didn't. Oh well. Um, and let's see what we can do. So we got really high confuse, and we got really high first strike and really high shield. It looks like. So, we're probably going to want to confuse all of these guys. Let's go right in, and I could for I'm going to want to first strike Doris. We're going to want to put her out and then first strike her. So, let's see. What to do? What to do? We really should have our, these guys in our out. Um, you know, let's send Doris out. She'll do some damage. And then we can first strike. We could send out Veroslav. We don't really have strong counter tactics, unfortunately, which is annoying. Um, So I definitely don't want her to be right in front, but it looks like she's going to be stuck right in front either way. So let's go ahead. Um, I have to confuse this him first um let's first action Veroslav so that we can get this first skeleton killed right away we'll send Bogna out she's going to be at the very rear unfortunately Unless we want to first action her. But I think confusing these two skeletons. He'll die before he gets a chance. So we don't have to worry about him. I could just first action or shield. First action or shield. Um. Oops, sorry. Hit my mic there. Um, I actually think first action might be better. Because. Eh, no, it won't be. It won't be. All right, we're going to shield you, and we're going to confuse him. And then we're going to go. All right. So he'll die right off the bat. And then Bogna attacks and nearly kills that one. So we'll kill this guy right away. Um, this one will not die, unfortunately. And then they both attack. Hopefully... There, and they're both going after Bogna. Nope. One of them went after Doris. Bogna kills that one. And now we just smash the last guy up to bits. Um, so let's just send Zoana out. End my turn. He will die right after the first attack, so I'm just gonna skip. Yep. And she'll Zoana will just kill it right off. All right, good. You have one. Fantastic. So Doris took one wound. That's it. We got some armor and stuff. Cool. And we leveled up. All right. Uh, Doris got health, which is great. Bogna got medic, and we got dex, strength, and tactics. And we got strength, health, and dex and stuff there. All right. Um, so let's see. So we could move. We'll probably move and kill this guy, but... That's going to be in the next episode. I'm going to end it here. Um, we are over our weight limit, so I will probably work on figuring that out too. Uh, too much weight to carry will make us it'll, it'll make us a lot slower to move. Because, yeah, we've only moved one, but we are over, so we lose like half our movement. So 
I'll see about um, either deconstructing or doing something with some of the resources. But I will do that in between episodes. That's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Till then, guys, bye bye